Hello children, today we shall do the structure of a tooth. All teeth, there are different types of teeth, incisors, canines, premolars, molars. There are different types of teeth, but the, in general the structure is the same. Each tooth consists of a root and a crown. The root is the part of the tooth that lies below the inside the gums okay it is embedded in the jawbone and then is the part above the root that is called the crown okay crown is the part that can be seen root it cannot be seen now the root has different types of fangs it's called fangs now the different teeth have different types of fangs like the incisors and the canines they've just got one fang each one fang these fangs are embedded in the gums the premolars and the lower molars premolars and the lower molars they have two fangs each Whereas the molars which are on top, molars which are on top have three fangs, okay? All these fangs are embedded in the gums. Now, coming to the structure of the tooth. Now, in between the crown and the root, in between the crown and the root is a narrow structure it's a narrow structure over here it's like a junction that is called the neck okay crown is the part which is exposed above the gums okay now the crown is covered by a very tough material known as the enamel enamel is the toughest material on the body then below the enamel is the material that makes up the uh, uh, entire tooth that is called the dentine dentine is also very tough material but it is not as tough as the enamel then inside to that is the pulp cavity the pulp cavity is rich in blood vessels it has lymph vessels too and it has nerves okay that is the pulp cavity. Now, the tooth remains embedded in the gums, yes, in the jawbone, by the help of a material which is known as the cement. The cement keeps it in its place. So, this is the structure of the tooth structure of the tooth the general structure of a tooth though there are many teeth but in general this is the structure thank you